it's on the ice. We have to get over to the snowy area. I can't go. Don't follow me. Go that way. No, I'm following you. No, no. 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 Is it cold? It's cold. Oh my god, wow, look how this is. If I didn't have my milk boots, I'd be if I had my sailboat tooth right now. We gotta get Bubba Chooch home. <laughs> I need to go fast, fast though. We need to go fast though. It got it got a little bit. Um and it got pretty high already. Yeah, let's go. Should I get the ATV? The kids over here, six and eight got a fire going. That's what I call survival, kids. Good job. I'm proud of you guys. That's wonderful. Do we need water right now? Um, yep, we're good. Water. You're good. We just watch it. It's going. Watch out. Hi, Nutmeg. Catch one is that your baby? Cinnamon, is that your baby? Um, I've been working on fire piles a lot, but I got this taken care of today. Um, a couple days ago, got that taken care of. So we just have those two burn piles and then two more over there we need to get. They're really wet, so it takes a while to get them going. But, um, yes, yeah, so we just have those three piles and then I'm just going to throw those extra ones on that pile. And then we got all the way over into here. And I got this one going right now. And then... I mean, obviously I haven't started that, but walking through here, I am very pleased. Um, I haven't, like, I wish that we were further along, but for doing, a, you know, an hour a day, 30 minutes a day, um, I've started to work a few more hours or like all day the last couple um, today. And then I did like half a day a few days ago. And then I did a couple hours yesterday over in a section on the other side of the cabin. Um, but isn't this amazing that like, look what it looks like when we get this cleaned up. It's just so incredible. And then you look into here and it's like, oh boy, we got a project, you know, um, got a project, but it's amazing. We can see through over here, there's a deer in the pasture out there and it's just beautiful. I just, this is what keeps me going and, um, it's just incredible to see the progress. And I just love being able to think about what I can do with um, this when it's cleaned up. Like we'll be able to enjoy it. We'll be able to sit out here and enjoy it this summer. And um, hopefully we won't have as much work. We have so much work to do with the animals and getting them better pastures and all that. But this is what it is. I'm actually thinking 
I was thinking that back there um, I would run the pigs in a big pasture area, like give them an entire acre. But now I'm thinking that um, we have this little ravine down here and it doesn't always fill with water. But if I gave them like the hill and then I gave them part of this ravine and um, just gave them a huge section that they could roam, how happy they could be. I'm gonna have different areas for the different pigs. Um, I'm thinking this might be for like, you know, I'll have to build some huts and stuff, but maybe this is where they have their babies. And then um, I would have another section for raising out feeder pigs and um, whatnot. But um, it's just so incredible to see these, this, this, it's cleaned up. It's amazing. I haven't um, come and trimmed some of these trees. I hate when I can't walk through there. So I've been trimming a little bit. Um, I don't want to get hit in the face. So I have been trimming them just up to where we can like kind of walk through them or whatnot. But maybe I can get these tomorrow when I burn this pile. But um, yeah, it's crazy. I'm very grateful that you guys are following along this amazing journey of ours. Um, this is hard. This is not easy. Um, the other day I was following a tree, the, um, tree just right over here. And I, um, uh, it was small and I was just going to go fall it to use for firewood. And I ended up, um, I cut it and it was like leaning up against another tree. For some reason I went to do another cut and I don't know why I did that. Anyways, it fell a little bit more. So then I backed up to check to see where the tree was at. And when I backed up, a limb fell off and it cut my face pretty good. Um, we're on day three and my eyes feeling much better. I'm not having to wear sunglasses anymore. Um, but for such a small twig, it really hurt bad. <laughs> We're dirty but um day three so i got a cut here one here a very good cut here here and then i must have blinked because i got a cut here and then one over here so um and that was a very small twig but it came from like probably 30 feet in the 